Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to crop a video or an image with Active Presenter 9. Okay, so in my previous tutorial, I show you how to record your computer screen with webcam audio from the microphone and system sound with Active Presenter 9 already. So now it's time to learn a new feature of the program. Okay, so let's go to my computer screen. All right, so th this is inside Active Presenter 9. So we need to import a video first. To do that, all we need to do is to click the Insert tab right here and then select Video and From File. Okay, so I'm going to use this one, a test video. Just click Open. Okay, so here is the video. For example, at this position, if you want to crop the video, you want to split the video on the timeline first. To do that, we can click this button to split the video. Okay, so here we have a video. And now what if we want to crop to this area? There are some options in Active Presenter 9 which allow you to crop the video. The first one is to go to the Format tab right here. Select the Format tab and then you can select the Crop Tool. Okay, just select it. And now you can adjust the crop area with this rectangular. Okay, so this is the first option to go to the Crop Tools. And the next option, just click away to get rid of the crop. The next option is to select the video here and then go to the property. So at the property, we can select this one, size and property. With this crop function, you can adjust the percentage on left, right and top and bottom. If you want to maintain the aspect ratio of the video, you want to input the same percentage right here for left, right, top and bottom. For example, I want to put it 20% from left and 20% for right, for top, I'm sorry, and 20% for right and 20% for bottom. And now we have a video like this. And if you want to scale it up to fulfill the screen, now you can just click here and then resize it to this. Okay, so this is a crop video and let's play it. Very nice, right? And now what if you want to go to full screen to get rid of the crop? All you need to do is to split the clip at the position you want to go full screen, okay? For example, I can put it the playhead at the, this position. And now I want to split the playhead here. And now we need to adjust the property of the video, okay? To do that, we can just select the video here and then go to the crop tools. The first thing we want to put the zero percentage right here for top top bottom left and right okay and this is for right and this is for bottom and press enter and now we have a full screen video by the way we need to adjust the scale of the video also because previously we have just scaled it up okay to do that we can click the video on the canvas and then resize it to the side of the canvas here and just make it full screen Okay, so here is the result. Okay, so that is for the video and now you can do the same for the image. For example, I can insert an image and let's click here. Okay, we can use this image as an example. Okay, just double click to insert. And now it will be inserted to your video and this is the image let's straight out the timeline first okay and this is the image i want to extend the duration of the image first okay for example i want to crop to this area of the image i can do the same just select the image here on the timeline and then go to property select this size and property and now we can use this crop button okay just click it and then we can adjust the crop area but for this example, I don't want to maintain the aspect ratio of the image, so I can freely adjust the area here. Okay, so I think it's okay. Just click away to get rid of the crop tools. And now I want to resize it and put it here on the right side of the video. And this is a crop image. Okay, so it is too fast. Let us extend the duration of the image a little bit longer. Okay, and this is the video with the image. 
Alright, so that is how you can crop a video or an image with Active Presenter 9. I hope this tutorial is helpful for you. If you have any more questions, just let me know at the comment section below. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.